What's going on guys, Alex here with another weird knife sharpening video. Today we are gonna be sharpening on a file. Now, I'm actually really excited about this because I've used files in the past to sharpen axes and they really leave a weird uh, scratch pattern in the edge of the axe. And I've never tried to take it all the way and really refine that edge. So it's gonna be kind of interesting what this does to a knife. And hopefully it leaves us with like some weird looking like micro serrated edge that's just crazy sharp. So first things first, we're gonna have to uh, go ahead and dull this knife. Uh, it's something I forgot to do last time when we sharpened on the old sharpening cup is I forgot to show the uh, dulling process and some people were actually doubting whether or not the knife was sharp or not in the first place. So we'll go ahead and dull the crap out of this thing. So I'm just gonna use the bottom of the uh, cup here and it really hurts to do this every single time. <laughs> but really is not a pleasant sound. About some old sandpaper. Just a little more for good measure. So there we go, one dull knife. So I'm gonna use just a wire brush here to make sure our file is clean. Typically you'd use something called a file card. I don't really have one of those. A wire brush does the same thing. And basically it just removes all the metal, uh, the built up metal inside these little grooves here and keeps your file. It really helps your file to uh, last longer when you keep it clean. I'll tell you one thing, it definitely doesn't sound great. This is definitely, um, not the most user-friendly experience here. So I can actually see we're starting to form a burr right here along the edge and I can feel it with my finger. We're still not completely there at the back end yet. So let me get this out of the way and pull out our DIY strap here. So one thing I'll say um, about stropping is generally the coarser the grit that you sharpen on, the harder or more difficult it's going to be to remove that burr. And generally the longer you're going to have, uh, the longer stropping session you're going to have. Now I have heard some people say that you can strop too much and I don't really find that to be the case. I've literally stropped for like a half an hour straight one time. And I think you kind of get to a point where you see diminishing returns but as long as you maintain an angle and you're not changing your angle all over the place, I don't really find that it dulls the knife any. I do think you get to a point where you see diminishing returns and it's just not necessary to go any farther. That's just my experience. Um, other people's experiences, I'm sure, differ. So I've spent the last, I don't know, five minutes on the strap here. And I think we've removed most of the burr at this point and it's actually turning out. Let's see if we can get this here. It'll focus. Yeah, the edge looks pretty decent. It actually feels relatively sharp. Um, I'm actually kind of surprised at how sharp it feels. Will it shave though? That's the question. So we'll go ahead and uh, try some newspaper here and see. I mean, it certainly, certainly cuts paper. I apologize, my neighbor's out weed whacking. It seems like as soon as I pull the camera out, everybody's out like mowing and weed whacking and stuff. I apologize if there's some ambient background weed whacker noise. I mean, let's check that out. And that's sharpened on a file. I was sharpened on this. So this is another test that I kind of like to do just to see the uh, condition of a blade is to just kind of take some six pound test fishing line and see if it um, will bite into the line without, you know, getting too close to my fingers. So I'd, I'll hold it like maybe a quarter inch away and see if it'll bite which this one doesn't. 
Now a really sharp knife will bite into this right away and just split the whole thing down. Um, so this definitely wouldn't pass the, oh my gosh, that's so crazy, insanely sharp. And I didn't really expect that from sharpening on a uh, file. And now they're using the leaf blower. They've been blowing the driveway for like the last hour. Hopefully they don't find this video online. All right guys, so sharpening on a file is definitely possible. It definitely gives you a halfway decent edge, believe it or not. Um, we can shave with it. We uh, can cut paper all day long. Um, it doesn't have that, oh my gosh, that thing is crazy, scary, sharp feel to it, but it would definitely get the job done in a pinch. How does it stack up against the old sharpening cup? Well, I think the sharpening cup would take it in a head-to-head uh, -head match, but I don't know. I'd have to really kind of put the two edges side by side and see how they uh, compare. But anyway, if you like this video, please like it, please subscribe, let me know what you think in the comments, and thanks for watching.